In this video, I'm going to show you how I install a bootable macOS on my external hard drive. Let's get started. Specifically, this bootable macOS will only work on the laptop or computer where you install it. First step. Download all the files needed. See link on the video description below. Choose any macOS version you prefer. I choose to install Big Sur OS for my Lenovo laptop. Next, download and install the CPU-Z software to determine your computer code name. Open the CPU-Z software and check your computer processor's code name. As you can see, I'm having a processor with a code name of Broadwell U. Next step, download the specific EFI for your computer. Open the specific folder based on the computer you're using. Download the specific EFI file based on your computer processor's code name. After downloading all the files needed, extract the macOS and EFI files. Plug in the USB flash drive on the computer. Format the USB flash drive. Open the extracted macOS folder and copy the com.apple.recovery.boot folder to the USB flash drive. Go back to the main extracted files and copy the EFI folder to the USB flash drive. Make sure the files inside the EFI folder contain the boot and OC folder, just delete the excess file. Rename the copied folder to EFI. Shut down the computer and plug in the Ethernet LAN cable. Turn on the computer and immediately open the BIOS settings. In the BIOS settings, set the boot priority to the USB flash drive. Click Save Changes and Exit. Select the macOS recovery. Plug in the external hard drive. Select a disk utility to format the hard drive to be suitable for macOS. Click the disk utility drop down arrow and select show all devices. Select the external hard drive. Select erase to reformat the external hard drive partition volume. Rename the external hard drive. Select the APFS format. Select the GUID partition map. Click Erase. The hard drive is now ready for macOS installation. Close the disk utility. Select the Reinstall macOS option. Select Continue to begin macOS installation. Click Agree. Select the external hard drive for macOS installation. The computer will reboot several times during the operating system installation and it will take about 30 minutes to an hour to complete the installation depending on your computer hardware. At this time the macOS installation is almost done.
finish all the required setup. Take note, the USB flash drive must be always plugged in to use macOS, we will fix that problem later on this video. And here you can see the system information, including its OS version, display, storage, memory, support and service. There's still a problem to solve, the USB flash drive must be always plugged in, to use macOS. To fix this, we need a tool called Mount EFI. I'll put a link on the video description below or you can search for it. After downloading the file, run the mount EFI command. To fix this, go to System Preference, Security and Privacy, then click Open. Select the drive where your macOS is installed. Enter your password. You can now access the operating system EFI folder. Open the USB flash drive and copy the EFI folder. Shut down and remove the USB flash drive. We're done. The bootable macOS installation was successful. Thank you for watching. Mr. Jackson.